lot of the folks that go through our program will become building principals. And building principals, everybody's important in a school. Building principals just kind of serve as the linchpin that keeps everything together and moving in the direction that you want things to move for school improvement. And I just, I, I know what a challenging job it is having served as a principal and to see people that are really up for that challenge and are invigorated by that opportunity is just fabulous. Um, also, people that are very open-minded, um, that they, they, recognize that they recognize the nuances in being in the field of education. So there's usually not necessarily a right or wrong. It's just like, what's the best right, given the situation that we're, we're um, moving through? And to be able to deal with that cognitive dissonance is really important if you're going to be in education, but especially if you're gonna be leading other people. Um, in the field and it's just fabulous to see these groups of educators as they move through the program like these dispositions just start to emerge in in a greater um, in a greater way so we see people at the first semester the first term you know a little bit more timid about saying things or questioning things and then last night when we were on this Zoom meeting with um, one of our cohorts, it's just like now they're just saying things like, why do we do this? You know, isn't there a better way to get at our intended outcome and just really thinking critically? And then the other thing that we're really proud of is that they do, they do work to link what we know from research with their day-to-day -day actions. So educators, these people that are in our program are working full time, they have busy lives with their families, um, but they're really thinking critically about what scholars historically and contemporary are saying we need to do to um, further our field on behalf of our kids. And they're, they're willing to like have those hard conversations and don't steer away from things that are uncomfortable. And you have to be able to have those uncomfortable conversations if you're a leader anywhere. Um, so yeah, I'm really jazzed about um, the principal candidates that we're serving and what, where their careers will take them and how they'll impact the kids and families that they serve.